Copper thieves are ruining activities for children in Jackson. Those playing at Grove Park can't do so at night because of the dark fields. As Roslyn Anderson reports, the crime is impacting a game that helps keep kids active and entertained. None of these have light but the Little League field. Thomas Cheatham Jr. with the Grove Park Baseball Association says teams have not been able to play night games for two years because thieves have stripped copper from the lights. Four of the five baseball fields are in the dark at night, impacting around 300 players. At night, they will keep them off the street, keep them doing uh, devilment things that we call it, keep them from doing things that they shouldn't do. Cheatham wants more upgrades. He says the pool is out of commission. There are no lights or nets at the tennis courts, and the road leading to the facility is in bad shape. We want our children to stay in this area to uh, have the activity. They want to play tennis, uh, they have to go somewhere else and play tennis. Two years ago, we had some uh, copper replaced there. Jackson's Parks and Rec's director says copper is stolen each time the lights are repaired. We're working uh, with our uh, partners out of Smith Wheels uh, Stadium, who's partnering with the Atlanta Braves and MLB, uh, to where we're at the table right now, talking and seeing what can we do in terms of money-wise, resources-wise, and otherwise uh, to be able to see if we can get this up and running uh, this year. Broken equipment at the pool has been repaired, but the city is in need of 14 lifeguards to open this and other pools in the city. At Grove Park, Rosalind Anderson, 3 on your side.